ओम शांति स्पार्क ऑडियो बुक अव्यक्त स्टेज अव्यक्त मुरली डेट थर्टी सिक्स नाइनटीन सेवेंटी फोर टूडे बाबा इज टेलिंग ऑल द चिल्ड्रन इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट द सटल रीजन ऑल ऑफ यू आर इंटरेस्टेड इन टूरिंग द सटल रीजन दैट इज इन सीइंग द सटल रीजन एट लीस्ट वंस आर यू नॉट डू यू नो वाई यू हैव दिस डिजायर और दिस थॉट बिकॉज बाप दादा प्लेस हिज पार्ट एज द रेसिडेंट ऑफ द सटल रीजन यू टू हैव द थॉट दैट टूगेदर विथ बाप दादा यू शुड ऑल्सो हैव द एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ दिस देर फॉर बाप दादा इज नाउ रिलेटिंग हिज ओन एक्सपीरियंस टू यू यू नो विच इज द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट टाइम टू हैव अ स्पेशल एक्सपीरियंस और टू हियर अबाउट दो सीन्स डू यू नॉट द टाइम ऑफ अमृत वेला इज ए स्पेशली फिक्सड फॉर द चिल्ड्रन आफ्टर दैट अकॉर्डिंग टू द ड्रामा बाबास टाइम इज फॉर द सोल्स ऑफ द रेस्ट ऑफ द वर्ल्ड एंड इज टू गिव दैम द फ्रूट ऑफ देयर डिवोशन अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर कैपेसिटी टू गिव सोल्स टेम्पोररी फ्रूट फॉर देयर रजो प्रधान एक्शंस परफॉर्म्ड फॉर ए टेम्पररी पीरियड फॉर हियरिंग द कॉल ऑफ द ट्रू भगत्स एंड टू ग्रैंड दैम विजन्स अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ फीलिंग्स to give the message to the brahmin souls of the previous kalpa who are still hidden everywhere in the task of making his children instruments to look after the scientists who are to become the instruments to finish the old world in helping the knowledgeable souls and the loving and cooperative children in carrying out the task of doing godly service throughout the day and in becoming the conquerors of maya according to the principle that the child receives the father's help by maintaining courage now do you understand what baba does throughout the day because of now being avyak sakar baba can now also play the part of being a companion and cooperating with the incorporeal father with a fast speed all the time so brahma baba the one who has an avyak body because of not being in the bondage of the body has quickly become a companion equal to the father at an intense speed he could not have become such a companion in the corporeal form why not what reason causes a difference between the corporeal form and the avyak form in the corporeal body he still had to give time to the physical body and sometimes he even had to use his powers for himself in order to settle the accounts of the suffering of karma so in the corporeal body he had to give time to the self to his children and to the world and because of being in a corporeal body he had to serve on the basis of physical facilities however in the avyakt form he doesn't have to take support of physical means even for himself in this way firstly because of being perfect there is fast speed of perfection secondly because of not using time and powers for himself there is a fast speed of service thirdly because of not having any perishable means of support the speed of thought is fast there is so much difference in terms of time and power between 
being able to reach somewhere with your thoughts and in reaching somewhere with your body in the same way there is also a difference between the speed of the corporeal and the avyakt scientists are trying to make their time and energy that is their labor and expansion of the facilities very subtle and minute they are making intense effort to reach somewhere in less than 1 second and are also successful in that just as the speed of the souls who are instruments for destruction is becoming subtle and intense so too the stage and speed of all the souls who are instruments for establishment should also be subtle and intense only then will both the tasks be accomplished so now do you understand the difference between the physical body and the avyakt body according to the drama for which service has baba become avyakt did you understand the significance of this the part of brahma is fixed till the end of establishment as long as the task of establishment is incomplete the part of the instrument soul brahma is not going to finish he cannot play another part until then the part of completing the new creation of the world father is fixed according to the drama it is only remembered for brahma that he created the progeny of the human world this is why he is remembered as the great great grandfather it is simply the stage the place and the speed that have changed the part of brahma is still the same many children's thoughts reach baba as to what baba is doing all this time baba is also now asking has the part of brahma being with brahmins in being instruments for bringing benefit to the souls of the whole world and of establishing the new world finished since the part has not finished and the world is not yet transformed how can the part of brahma be finished because of love there is the thought of what brahma would be doing in the certain region all this time do you ever have the thought of why and how brahma baba has the part in the subtle region for all this time this too is of incognito significance the soul who is free from the bondage of karma who has become perfect who has finished the cycle of rebirth in this kalpa who is the first companion of the incorporeal father the first soul to become an instrument for world benefit the soul who has attained total success for the self and in terms of the world can fully play a part whenever wherever he wants and for as long as he wants since souls who have attained temporary occult powers can change their form on the basis of their powers can the soul who has attained total powers of success and is in an avyakt body not remain where he wishes for as long as he wants what is the reason for bringing the soul from the incorporeal or avyakt stage into the corporeal form first is the bondage of karma second is the bondage of relations third is the bondage the part of the physical world and the bondage of the body as soon as the costume is ready the soul is pulled from the old costume into the new costume so just think about all these bondages from the vyakt form to the avyakt form the bondage of the part of establishment is being carried out with even greater speed now within this kalpa there aren't the bondages of attraction to the body of others as a bodily being 
he has finished the all the bondages of all karmic accounts since the soul has become free from all karmic accounts the physical body and the physical world cannot pull the soul just as when scientists go beyond the pull of gravity into space the earth cannot pull them in the same way as long as the time for playing his part in the new kalpa in a new life and in the new world has not come until then this soul is completely free and is free from physical bondages do you understand therefore do not now have many different thoughts how can brahma baba not fulfill the promise he made to the brahmin children of going home together of living and dying together that is of finishing the part so how can he not finish the contract he has taken of bringing about world transformation can instrument who is the foundation for the task of establishment be removed in between whatever actions everyone sees me perform they will do the same will souls who are instruments for performing karma not enact the slogan at present you are performing actions for service on seeing the father souls who are instruments to demonstrate the performance of karma will definitely be companions and remain cooperative till the end Avyak Murli did 15 9 1974「Do you know what the ultimate effort is? In the beginning you made effort to finish body consciousness with the awareness of being Chaturbhuj, four-armed image. And through this you were able to remove the consciousness of being a woman as well as any weaknesses or cowardice and you thereby became fearless and powerful. So, in the beginning, you made practical effort to finish body consciousness by having the awareness of being Chaturpuj. Whilst walking and moving around or while talking to someone, you had the intoxication that you were not a woman but that you were Chaturbhuj. Both these sanskars and both these powers became combined through which you are able to carry out both tasks. In the same way, what ultimate objective should you keep in your awareness through which you will automatically develop these qualifications? What is the ultimate objective? of making effort it is to become an avyakt angel what is the avyakt form to be angelic in this also you should have your form of light in front of you as your objective by keeping that in front of you the feeling will be that this is your form in an aura of light You see your avyakt form in the subtle region. So what difference do you see between the avyakt and the vyakt? The vyakt form is in an aura of five elements and the avyakt form is in an aura of light. You do have the form of light, but all around you there should also be nothing but light, as though This form is visible in an aura of light. It should be just as when you look at the sun, all around you see light from the rays of the sun and in the middle you see the form of the sun itself. There is the light of the sun but all around the light of the sun is also spread everywhere and visible in the form of an aura. It is as though 
you see a special light amidst the light in this way although you have the aim as a soul of being the form of light in the avyakt form you are also in an aura of light you should be able to have the awareness of your form being surrounded with light and it should also be visible everywhere when you look in a mirror you are able to experience seeing your form clearly in the same way this form of yours should be clearly seen and experienced in the mirror of knowledge while you are walking and moving around and talking to others others should experience you as a form of light that you are an angel walking around that you an angel are talking to someone only then will you be able to influence others with your awareness and stage while performing any task increase this awareness i am an instrument angel who has stepped on to this earth for this particular task but i am actually a resident of the avyakt region i have incarnated for the sake of this task that is it is as though i have come from my home to carry out this task and as soon as the task is completed i will return home just as when the father comes he has the awareness that he has come from his home to carry out a particular task and that he has to return home in the same way all of you should increase the awareness that you are an incarnation that has incarnated at the moment i am a brahmin and later i will become a deity in fact this too is gross form of awareness because even this is the corporeal stage now all of you should have an angelic stage because it is only after being angelic that you will easily be able to become incorporeal the father became angelic from being corporeal then from being angelic he will become incorporeal and then he will once again have a corporeal form now all of you also have to reach the stage of being the residents of the subtle region for only then will you be able to return with the father why did this part of going from the corporeal to the avyakt form take place to stabilize all of you in your avyakt stage because as yet you have not reached that stage now this is the final effort that remains through attaining this form you will be able to grant visions there are many points of intoxication for the corporeal form for example i am an elevated soul i am a brahmin i am a shakti with this awareness you will experience intoxication and happiness however until you experience yourself in your angelic form in an aura of light others will not be able to have vision of you this is because whatever visions of the deity form the bhagats have that will only be possible when you stay in your aura of light while walking and moving around visions cannot be granted without light only when you stabilize yourself in your form of light will others have a vision of you through the influence of your form of light it has been portrayed in the scriptures that when kans the demon king tried to kill the kumari she flew away she became one who appeared as vision and spoke from the ether 
in the same way others should have visions of you so that they would experience sound coming from the ether from you as a goddess and they would want to listen to what this goddess or shakti is going to say to them from the ether this newness should now be visible in you what should not be ordinary but there should be the experience that words are being spoken from the ether this is why you are told that it is now the time to become like an intense fire now your part of being a gopi has finished the part of the maharatis who are moving forward is now automatically changing into doing service in this way in the beginning you used to give lectures etc and you used to give the course now you speak very little as a chairperson and your companions give the course etc at present the service to attract others to put zeal and enthusiasm in them and give them courage still remains to be done and so there is a difference as you go further ahead and it will be experienced as though someone is speaking from the ether they will say that you are an incarnation that you are not an ordinary bodily being but an incarnation that has emerged just as when people have vision of a goddess it is as though she appears in front of them and speaks elevated versions and then disappears so to this is the stage and objective of the effort that you should now be making now you should be going beyond all physical activities through signals listen give a direction and then return to the certain region just like you saw and experienced the sakar form he came down gave directions heard everything and then went up above and beyond there should be a visible difference like that of day and night between the activities of the beginning and the end now your responsibilities will increase even more don't think that when you become an angel your responsibilities decrease no responsibilities and the expansion of service will increase even more just as service in the foreign lands has now increased and expanded in the same way all the different types of service will also definitely increase in the scriptures there is reference to the upliftment of every type of soul this happened practically and this is why it is remembered for women all this will happen at present you are sitting in one place but later you will have to look after places you will not be able to sit in one place at present you stay in one place for 6 to 8 months however later you will have to be able to do service in all four corners as a lighthouse the main serviceable instruments who are to claim the throne to the fortune of the kingdom will continue to give light to many places like a revolving lighthouse there has to be the practical form of a lighthouse one light will give light to many others even if in name sake you are sitting in one place it is not possible for someone who is a master of the unlimited world to be responsible for a limited area a lighthouse which is positioned in one fixed place doesn't serve just one place but spreads its light in all four directions in the same way you may be in just one place but benefit from your specialities and powers has to be spread all around until now your specialities have only been benefiting one place does the sun give light to just one area 
so your special rays of powers should also be spread in all four directions how else would you be proved to be master almighty authorities and the stars of knowledge to be a master son of knowledge means to be like father while being stars it is also means to have a similar stage to that of the father only the eight jewels will attain this stage if a father spreads its light in just one area or sparkles giving light to just its own area that star would not be called a master son or a son of knowledge similar to the father unless you reach a stage equal to the father's you cannot claim the throne that belongs to the father therefore make your stage such that service increases only by being a spinner of the discus will you become an emperor who is a ruler of the globe by being one who spins the discus here you will be a ruler of the globe here only when you are a spinner of the discus the discus that spreads light in service will you be called one who spins the discus only those who are the spinners of the discus can become the rulers of the globe as you walk and move around everyone will be able to see a discus of light as though they are seeing it with their physical eyes they will be amazed and wonder whether what they are seeing is reality or whether it is something that they alone can see your form of light and crown of light will become so common that everyone will be able to see you wearing a crown of light as you walk and move around just as it was a common thing to experience light from the corporeal form so everyone should be able to see you in that form as though they are actually seeing it with their physical eyes you will experience that while seeing this they themselves will begin to disappear where am i what am i seeing you used to experience this through the corporeal form and sometimes you even used to be amazed with yourself are my feet here or in the incorporeal world or in the subtle region just as you had experienced through the sakar form so others will now experience this through you and only then will you reach the stage of being equal that will only be possible when in between you continually bring your form into your awareness sakar baba made this incognito effort in the same way all of you also have to make this incognito effort or incognito work do you pay this much attention even while having tension there should be attention at present you still have time to rest during the day and night but later there won't be time to take a rest however the more you stabilize yourself in the avyakt form and the more you practice remain beyond the body even if you become bodiless for 2 to 4 minutes the more it will feel like you have had 4 hours of rest a time will come when instead of sleeping you will simply be bodiless for 4 to 5 minutes so that just as the body receives its rest nourishment through sleeping in the same way you will receive this nourishment the body will be same as old body of course your old karmic accounts will still exist but there will simply be this addition by making this awareness of the form of light strong you will become the form of light when it comes to settling accounts when an injection is given you see a difference in 5 minutes and even when a sleeping tablet is taken 
all distress is finished in the same way you should also think that you are taking the nourishment of sleep this practice is for bringing about such a stage at amrit vela also have the special practice of having incarnated sometimes consider yourself to be a bodiless resident of paramdham or that you have incarnated in the avyakt form and sometimes consider yourself to be incorporeal you should practice having these three stages in such a way that it feels like you are going from one room to another so at amrit vela there should be a special experience of claiming the blessing of being bodiless acha om shanti